Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. Jay Whitaker is a former Carnegie Mellon University engineering professor whose work was featured in the Mars rover program. He is also the creator of the Edible Battery, better known as the Aquion Energy Battery System. Inspired to create safe battery storage, he founded his company back in 2008. You can eat, if you can physically chew everything that's in the battery, you can technically eat it. That is how safe it is. President of Canada's second largest renewable energy distributor, Sentinel Solar, so Adam Webb, Webb, endorsed the technology while meeting with local stakeholders in May. He said Aquion's aqueous hybrid ion batteries are made from abundant, non-toxic and sustainable materials, including salt water. The batteries are manufactured in a state-of-the-art 350,000 square foot facility in southwest Pennsylvania and produce residential, commercial, industrial and utility grade power storage systems. With an estimated lifespan of 15 years, the batteries also perform better in Guam's hot climate. And you will actually get more power out of this battery from 25 to 50 degrees which is one of the reasons why this battery has been flooding the tropical, I'll say tropical locations uh, or high humidity, high heat locations around the world. Randy Sager is president of Reaction Co., the company that will be distributing the batteries on island in the next few months. He said the technology allows people to take the sun's energy and hold on to it for later use. You are now running on no GPA. There is no cents per kilowatt charge for you. You're running on your own power. And you can do this until the next morning at 12 hours, until you give it up at 6 o'clock for your coffee. For more information, you can call Reaction Co. at 477-1018. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Issa Baza. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.